Hey family, came on right quick to um really, I mean I know it's for the masses, well the masses see it, but really um, it's for my girl Kane. Um, me and Kane was um, texting this morning and I was telling her about some things that I got going on and so she was like, well Tina, what you gonna wear? Well Kane, when, you, when me and you was talking, I think I had went to... Um, I went to Dee Dee's first, and then, let's see, Dee Dee's opened at 9.30, then I left Dee Dee's, and I went to Joann's, then I went to Kmart, and then I went to the 99 cents only store, then I went to Long John Silver's, and then I'm just getting home. Now, how about as soon as I pull up in my driveway, girl, I get up, I, I get out the car and everything, and I had Anthony... You know, getting all the stuff out of the back of the truck. So here, knock at the door. Now, you know, I mean, I could be cantankerous about certain things. My thing is, if you're going to show up at my house, call me before you come. You know what I'm saying? Don't just show up because, you know, I want shit to be in order. Not saying that my house is jacked up, but, you know, still, call me. And if and you don't know what the fuck I'm doing, don't just show up at my motherfucking door. And then, you know, expecting to be, you know, come in and have a, uh, you know, tall glass iced tea. Because it ain't going down like that. Now, as soon as I come in, I'm raggedy as all get out. Okay? Ready, robed, and all that. Been gone all morning. And as soon as I pull up in my driveway, boom, 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 boom. Here go one of my cousins. You know what I'm saying? And so, Tony was here. And Anthony was here. So, they, you know, they, they, you know, unloading the truck. Girl... When I tell you I went on one a while ago, your girl went on one a while ago. Okay, I'm an emotional, I'm an emotional eater, and I'm an emotional shopper, and that's just what I do. But when I emotionally eat, I emotionally eat sweets. So, um, so today was an emotional eating day because um, I had my my um my juice this morning, and then after the juice. I bought me some Long John's, but I didn't get fries. I got me a piece of fish. I got me a piece of fish, and I got me four shrimp and a side of clams. But this is all that I, I will eat today. So, see, I had, I, believe it or not, I've already eaten out of this already. I had the clams, but I'm full now, so I can't eat anything else. So, it'll take me about the rest of the day to eat this, but I won't eat anything else. So, that's what's up on that. But anyway, girl, my cousin comes over, knocks on the door, her and her son or whatever. And I feel bad now because, you know, she was like, well, she told Tony, she said, I just saw her driving down the street. And he was like, well, yeah, well, you know, she's not here, though. I'm standing behind the motherfucking door. Now, mind you, now, I got double doors, okay? I got double door entryway. Glass, okay? So, and I'm like... You know what I'm saying? And then the kitchen, the kitchen window is open. So she hearing me saying, tell him I ain't here. That was raggedy. I mean, I feel bad, but they done went on down the road. They done left. So hell, fuck it. I didn't. But you know, I mean, hear my dogs at the door. And my dogs is just barking in high heaven. You know what I'm saying? Because my dogs don't know them, you know? So my dogs is like, I mean, just ankle bottom. So anyway. So I just had to share that right quick, girl, because it's just it just happened like literally about three to five minutes ago. So after Tony them and came and threw all this shit on my bed, and now um, him and Anthony is going to go get some haircuts, and um, so that's what's up. So anyway, let me show you, um, girl, what I got today. I got up. I went to Dee Dee's. What I was looking for is um um. I wanted me some more chairs for when I go to the jazz festivals and stuff. And the chair that I want, so keep an eye out on me because, you, you know, you're a Virgo. You shop like I shop. So, um, I want to know. Now, last year, I saw this girl had the lawn chairs. You know, that's in the bag. But it was pink. And it was the lounge ones, you know, where you lay out and it was in the bag. I want that one. So, they didn't have that one. So, I ended up buying two with the awning on the top, but they was they was pretty tight though. So I bought those. I bought two of those, and I bought a um a picnic mat, you know, to go up under my chairs and shit. Cause I don't like my, I have a big sticker about my things on my hands and things underneath my feet. 
So I have this mat to go. I'm going to show you the pictures because when we go to the Jazz Festival on Saturday, and then, of course, I'm going to be taping it so you'll be able to see what it looks like. But, girl, I got it all filleted out. But how about, wait a minute, let me tell you how cold bitch was. Bitch bought candles. Yeah. I bought candles. I bought plates. Um, Because I, I bought a table and chairs that also go in the bag. But, you know, because I like to play bones. So while I'm out there, me and my auntie, we, shit, we can sit at the table and play some bones. You know what I'm saying? So I got domino hookup, and then I bought some um, nice, like, wine glasses. You know, the plastic ones, though. You know what I'm saying? The nice little cute ones for outside. Girl, I bought the whole get out. And plus, and don't fuck with me, because bitch, even, well, I had that last year, though. But I bought the, um, the, um... You know those baskets that they have at the grocery stores and you could like the little ladies, they buy all that stuff and in case they walking or whatever, all that stuff fit in their little basket and they just push their bag down the street. Well, I bought one I bought two of those last summer. Well, I bought one for last summer and then I got one off of Clarence Sater Brothers a couple months ago or whatever. So now I got two of them. So what I'm gonna do is when I go to my jazz festivals, I like to bring a lot of stuff. I like to have my whole little section filleted out. I like my chairs to match. I like my, um, my, you know, my stuff to be just laid out real nice, real classy looking. So, and then I bought a nice flask and, you know what I'm saying, for a little drink, drink, and drink, you know what I'm saying? Because, see, I don't really do the drinky drink, but everybody else do a little drinky drink. And I don't want them to just be busting out with a Cabasier fucking bottle. You know what I'm saying? And here, all these people out here and everybody. First of all, you ain't supposed to bring shit in there no how. But then, girl, they turn around and bring the whole motherfucking Cavassier bottle and shit. You know, and see, I was like, nah, we ain't finna do that. We ain't finna come up in this motherfucker with no goddamn, um, what's that other shit? And my auntie likes something else. She likes some Gato, Gallo, Galo, something. All that stuff. But, you know, and y'all, girl, how about, now, I like pina colada, right? Girl, do you know the long bottle like that? Bitch put it up under her breast like that and walked right on into the jazz festival. Holla. Okay, because you know you're not supposed to take that shit in there. But, you know, as big as these girls are, I can put a chicken in there and you would never see it. So I put a whole bottle of um of pina colada in there and walked right on in. So, girl, so anyway, side note. So anyway, you'll be able to see it on Saturday because I'm going to have it, you know, all you know, filleted out and all that kind of stuff. And, you know, I kind of want me a nice easy up. But see, the thing is with those easy ups, you know, some places they don't want you to come out with this big ass awning and all that kinds of shit. You know what I'm saying? They don't want you to come out there with all that kind of stuff. So, and then I was like, I want me a radio flyer. They was like, what? What's that? I said, a wagon, bitch. I want to put my shit in the motherfucking wagon and tow that motherfucker. You know, all my shit because, and then don't mess with me because I got citronella candles and yeah, I be on some whole other shit, y'all. When I be out and about like that and doing my thing, I like my shit to look very classy and well put together. Fuck with me, we gonna be up here barbecuing some, some ribs tomorrow and gonna take them bastards and that... Okay. I'm the only one that take food in, I guess. But anyway, yeah. So, um... But I went to Dee Dee's. I don't know if they got Dee Dee's in your area. But, girl, I went to Dee Dee's, and I bought me a um, soft bonnet and a dryer. And I got the hard hat one, the hard one. But, see, if I want to, you know, put a hot oil treatment on, on, on my hair or something, you know, and I want to be back here posting up in my room, I can't do it with the big hard hat because the hard hat has to sit on the table and stuff, and you just, you know, stuck with it. So, when I saw this, I said, oh, okay, let me get this. So, I got this, and this will be for me and my daughter's um hair because I also put uh hot oil treatments and shit on her hair too so I got that one and I thought that was pretty cute and then I um I got me a um a total bit a total fitness body kit you know with the bands and all that kinds of stuff so yeah I got me one of those and I thought that was pretty cool so I got that and I got um some earphones you know because my son with his earphones I don't know you know I got those for him really so I got him some earphones. But guess what else? You know, I, girl can't go nowhere without, you know, finding her some kind of little funny style ass purse. You know what I'm saying? So I got this with, look how fast she is, girl. I got me a pair of this color. I got me, oh shit, I didn't know I had these. I wasn't supposed to get both of them. I was only wanting one gold pair. 
Girl, I was on one this morning. I ended up with these. And I got white. And I got me, how about this tank top right here, though? Okay? How about this tank top right here? But it stretches a lot. You know what I'm saying? But it says love. But how about this, though? How fast she is. Bam. To go with it. You know what I'm saying? Just put me on some jean shorts and just rock my little tank top like that. I thought that was kind of cute. One size fits. Well, I guess the titties will just be up in there, won't it? Okay. So then, but I thought it was kind of cute. It was just something that I just picked up and I was digging it. Um, I bought a whole lot of um, these right here is prep bowls when I'm cooking stuff for you guys. And they were on clearance too for $2.99. And, you know, to have, like, your salt and your, you know, all your condiments and stuff that you're going to put together when you're cooking. But for $2.99, I was like, oh, my God, I got to have it. It's just way too cute, and it looks nice on, you know, a nice presentation when you're cooking. So, um, I got these ones, and then I think I got another um, uh, thing of colors like this on other little sets, too. But I left that, Tony them left that in the kitchen because I don't even know why this was in here. But I guess because... Um, you know, they was looking at the fact that, you know, all these bags is closed. So, they just brought that back here. But that didn't really needs to go in the kitchen. I'm going to take those other shoes back, too. Because those were supposed to be here. And then, what else did I get, Kane? Let me see. I don't know. I just like this. I just thought it was kind of cute. You know? I just thought it was kind of cute. You know? So I just liked it and just going and picked him on up. I like that. I got a pair of pants for Tioni. And then I got me a pair of um, headphones for my iPod. Just some extra ones. And then I got me another pair of sandals too. Holla at your girl. And um, these were eleven nine. Oh, I didn't know they was eleven ninety nine. But, yeah, these were eleven ninety nine though. But I still just thought that they were so cute. Because I just like all of this detail on them. And then I like a lot of bohemian type stuff. You know, I like that. And for the summer, that that's pretty much going to be my get down. Is I want a lot of, um, you know, that type of stuff. Earthy type stuff. So, then, while I was talking to you, while I was going back and forth with you on text messages. And then the last text you sent me was, what was I wearing? Well... And I know everybody else saying, where's she going? Where's she going? Where's she going? Where's she going? You'll see the video. I don't want no motherfucker sending me no bullshit ass hate mail. So I just y'all see the video on where I'm going. I got a fun filled weekend though. But I also went to Kmart. When I went to Kmart, came uh when I went to Kmart, um, and got those chairs and things. Excuse me. And you had sent me, remember you sent me that um uh, private video? Okay, girl, guess what? So I got mine in white, okay? And at Kmart, this was $13.99 at Kmart. But after mama get done with it, after I get done with it, it's going to be off the chain. And I wanted it white anyway because my new purse that I just bought is white. And then I bought the new little kick. I'm going to do a lot of white too. This summer, it's just white. It's just clean. To me, it's just a clean look. And see, these are white. And these are actually a size 9, but they fit very well. So, and I was surprised. They didn't have a 10. And I wear I wear a 10, but they didn't have a 10. And, um, but they had, um, a 9. And the 9 fit very well. So, I was like, okay, well, boom, I'll just roll with the 9. But, yeah. But, um, I'm going to show you this. On how I do mine, mama. Yeah, I got that. I got, um, uh, you already gave me the insight on what all I need to do. And mama got it. You watch and see. So, yeah, I'm going to hook that one all the way up. And that's going to be my summer, uh, you know, my summer, my summer little get down when I'm out at my different functions and things. So, the last message you sent me was, what you going to wear? Tell me what you going to wear. Well, I get to, at that time I was at Joanne's, okay. So when I'm at Joanne's, girl, my mind was just on one because I was like, okay, I got to think. You know, I don't want to wear, though I do have a whole lot of clothes, 
But for some reason, there's times when I get ready to go somewhere, I want to wear something new. And so, I don't double back a lot of times. Like, if I wear something, I won't double back for probably a good month or two before I wear that same outfit again. Whereas, just like last summer, the jazz festivals that I went to last summer, I wore those outfits and I never wore them again. It's crazy. I mean, I, I, and so, and then I just give away a lot of my clothes because I don't like to double back. I don't want, I, I don't want, didn't that bitch wear that a couple months ago? You know what I'm saying? Not saying that that's a big deal, but, you know, I just don't double back. And especially if I'm taking pictures and all that kind of stuff like that, and then motherfucker bust up and be like, wait a minute, she had that on, didn't she have that on when she went to Coronado? Okay, yeah, she had that on. Wait a minute, nah, I saw that bitch with that on in New York. You know what I'm saying? Fuck that. You ain't finna give me one of them. You know what I'm saying? I'm too crafty for that motherfucking shit. Now, you might see me with a jacket or two or some accessories that I might double back on. But for the most part, if I'm going to a function or going to something, I just don't like to double back. I don't like to double back. Now, I might do a little twist to it, kind of switch some things up with it, but I can't wear it the same way I wore it that time. Like, um, okay, but that was just, what, a month ago? Like, all the little jumpers and things that I've been wearing, I've only worn them that day, and I've never worn them again. So I have, like, all these shits just in my closet, just hanging up, because I just never wore that shit again. Like, once I wore it, it was a wrap. Like, when I went to my auntie's, um, my uncle's 50th birthday party. And I made a jumper sp specifically for that. I have not worn that jumper again. Once I wear it, it's a wrap after that. <laughs>